What's going on, Guardians? Mid Frost here, Wolfing Around Gaming. Now, <clears throat> I know our channel has been a little dry. We've been uh, working on a montage here for a little while. And uh, it's uh, it's taken some time. Uh, thought we'd have it out this week, but we had a few setbacks. Uh, one of the things that I've done, done recently is changed my PvP fighting style. Now, over the course of the month, I've managed to take my KD from like a 1.1, so to speak, to well over 2.0. Um, here I have uh, some recorded gameplay of that. But there's also been some exciting news as well. We had the Destiny 2 reveal today, which was phenomenal. The, the, the new style of it, the weapons. <clears throat> The backgrounds, uh, the whole game itself looks incredible. Now, what I've got here in my hand is Cade, St Cade Six figurine. Now, we're giving this away uh, through our channel on YouTube. There's a link in the description. Uh, I think the winner will be drawn in probably 20, 25 days. I think the winner, I'll mail it to you. Um, that's for our subscribers. So. As always, like and subscribe. We really appreciate it. We're almost at the 150 mark. I know it's kind of small in terms of all the other people out there, but uh, we're going to continue to bring uh, some Destiny content your way. Not so much glitches or walkthroughs, but uh, definitely some PvP stuff, Trials of Osiris, our montages especially. We're working on our dual Taj, my son and I. My son is Dragons. Um, I, I'm of course Mid Frost. So we're working on our first dual Taj. He's going to be Mr. Clutch and I'm Mr. Shutdown. To give you an idea, he's the one who clutches everything in Trials of Osiris. Uh, for me, on the Shutdown side, I, I get great pleasure in shutting down supers. And uh, my side of it, none of the clips were done in Mayhem. I did not cheese it and shut down, uh, shut down supers in Mayhem. I did it all through either Control or Clash. Uh, I worked hard for it. It took a lot of time. Um, but uh, yeah, here's, uh, here's some gameplay of my new fighting style. Clash. Sorry, it won't be uh, live, game, uh, live gameplay footage, only because for some reason when I stream and record all at the same time, it doesn't kind of work out too Victory well. So. Here we go. I can pretend like I'm playing. Yeah, I got robbed right there. I don't know what it is. I'm usually the first death of any match. <clears throat> but uh, I am rocking a Defender Titan. Uh, with weapons of light. It basically turns that horrible snipe I just did right there into uh, a sick... Did you see that? That was totally in the head. I, I've been having this lately. It just goes forwards with the snipe. Look, another headshot and you hit him probably in the foot. I'll take care of that guy. Um, rocking weapons of light with uh, Icebreaker. <clears throat> Makes my uh, Titan... A golden gun titan with reloadable shots. I mean, uh, the one shot kill with weapons of light, uh, it's just, it's fun. <clears throat> I'm stuck in the corner there. There we go. But uh, on this new uh, fighting style, I've increased my kills per game from probably around. 10, 12 kills per game to uh, a little over 20, sometimes even higher. I've had it upwards of around 30 or so. <clears throat> but it, it makes it a little more fun to actually be doing something relevant and crucible. Um, see, yeah, that was a headshot. Did I even kill that guy? I don't think so. But uh, it, it makes it a little more fun to play instead of dying all the time. See, I don't get it. There's no lag in this game either. 
I check the I check the bars on it later on. And there's nobody lagging. For some reason, the shots weren't lagging. <clears throat> Sidearm shots, he would have had something. That's the other thing I like. I'm switching off the icebreaker. Oh, it's like I jumped right into that, but they were close enough to each other to double them up. <clears throat> I like switching off the icebreaker after a body shot because it's just one pulse hit to drop a guy after that. You can usually switch pretty quick. There. Good old analysis. This picks up here in a minute. <clears throat> it's clearing these guys out. I mean, this room is a strict disadvantage. You hold down the room, you hold down the game. That's just the waiting room. So yeah, we'd like to be putting out <clears throat> more videos and stuff for everybody, but you know, I work full time. I'm actually on my lunch break right now recording this. So yeah, I'm not typically on a lunch break or something I'm playing, but not a whole lot of time. But one thing I'd like to say is uh, for Destiny 2, September 8th, uh, we will be running a 24-hour live stream open fire team party. So basically between me and Dragons, we'll take on uh, <clears throat> whoever wants to join. Heavy ammo inbound. But I'm hoping I can do a 48-hour live stream. That's only a time permits for it. The 24-hour is uh, something I'm definitely looking forward to, <clears throat> especially with all the, all the new gameplay coming with it. I just got tired of waiting to jack the heavy. If nobody else is coming in, I'll pick it up. I swear, it's like the slowest gameplay with these guys. They're just hiding and hiding. There we go. Blue. I don't know where that sniper shot came from. They just kneecapped me. What was he doing just standing there? It's like he was begging for it. Only five minutes to uh, the other thing I'm going to be uploading here pretty soon is my very first 1v3 in elimination. It wasn't in trials. I don't have people who say, hey, join up so you can leave. 
but uh, I finally had an option to do a 1v3 in elimination uh, for the first time. So just because I, I just play with randos, whoever joins up, or, or matchmaking, I guess you could say. Um, and uh, they bailed halfway through it. And uh, I got to do a 1v3, which was, which was pretty cool. Because I'm not exceptional at, uh, at 1v3 at all. Not like uh, City of Gaming or anybody like that. And Gooch and uh, JMP. Which uh, we're also kind of excited about with the JMP. With JMP is uh, uh, Dragons had a chance in one of his uh, videos to uh, take him on. And uh, yeah, it was pretty cool. Kind of gave a little call out to Dragons and that. The Dragons was on a 10 kill streak in his uh, APN Zephalog review. I don't know what it is, dude. These, these snipes have just been the death of me in this game. Yeah, it's just kind of been the, the camp and wait game. See, I finally get that guy. For some reason, my shot is off by like a millimeter, and it just doesn't register. teammates couldn't take out a blade dancer, but he went through all of them pretty well. But yeah, I've, uh, the, with my new play style, um, on Destiny Tracker, I was like rank, like gold or rusted in uh, Clash, and it's all I ever played really was Clash Control. Um, I've gone to Diamond. Uh, I went Diamond within like two days. And I pretty much maintained it for about a month. Supremacy Clash. Uh, I was just ripping people up for that. I mean, like, it, it was really sad for them. I had a video out. If you check our channel out, there's a video on there. It says, I hate Supremacy. And I was running dual sniper back from the meta change to uh, sidearms. And <clears throat> I, I just said, you know what, screw it. I'm going to run dual sniper. And uh, I tore him up pretty good, but... I, I just really hated Supremacy. I, I didn't like it at all, but now, oh, it's like my go-to match. It's just keeping distance. Keeping distance, letting them come to you. Like I said, it's probably like one of the slowest gameplays, because all these guys are just hiding out in corners. And... It would have gone a lot faster had half of my bullets not been ghost bullets. That would, that would have been better. But I'm going to try and get uh, some other gameplay of the new uh, my new play style. Hopefully better uh, than the slowest gameplay imaginable right now. It's just guys are all hiding out. And how that guy couldn't headshot me while I was just sitting there. That, that, that's just terrible. Yeah, that's a. Uh, this is the gameplay. Um, I've got other clips. Uh, another thing uh, I'm thinking about adding to the channel is something else uh, nobody else is really doing, but I'm calling our the, the new segment that uh, I'll be working on here pretty soon is How Did I Survive? No, that's wrong. No, I think I'm going to call it I Shouldn't Be Alive. Basically, the other guy has just dropped you to no help, and somehow you managed to pull it off and kill him and survive. So it's the, I shouldn't be alive. And as you can see there, I think my KD was something. But, uh, where is it at? Yeah, 6.3. So, I don't know how it was that high, but, you know, what was it, 19 and 3? So there it is. Um, keep your distance. Raise your KD. Um, get a beat on people. Uh, headshots, especially with pulse rifles, 
Um, but yeah, that's that's how that's how I'm working it now. But uh, the new segment, I shouldn't be alive. Uh, I'll probably be working on those clips maybe next week. I've only got a few right now, only because some of them are just outrageously crazy. But uh, again, this is for our giveaway. Description is in the link. Uh, it's our Kid Six statue. I haven't even opened it, so it's completely unopened, brand new, uh, GameStop exclusive. I'll ship it anywhere. Give me your address if you're international. Tell me how to ship it internationally. I, I'd like to get it to you. I have no problems on that. So, uh, like, subscribe, uh, comment. Uh, let us know what you want to see from us. Uh, we'll try and put it all together for you. Like I said, we're still a relatively new channel. We've probably been around five months or so. Um, we do like running uh, open fire teams. If you see, if you see me online, uh, message me. I only got limited time to play during the week um, and on the weekends uh, I gotta take care of the family but uh, I typically do crucible so if you see me on uh, I might be able to join sometimes I don't but uh, yeah hit me up I don't mind running a few crucible matches before I can get off uh, thanks a lot guardians and see you out there